here I have two different dates in the cell A1 and B1 and I want to count the number of years that we have between these two dates. So for this I'll use a function that is called dated if and this function is not there in the excel list but you can still use it. So I'll use uh, so I'll enter the function date diff and in the first argument because this function is not in the excel's functions list I need to specify the arguments. So the first one argument is the starting date and the second argument is the ending date. Now in the third argument I need to define the unit that I want to get from this function. So I want years. I'll enter double quotation marks and y small y and after that I'll close the function. Now this function returns 8. That means there are 8 complete years between these two dates. Now if I want to get the months, uh, the months which are after the 8 years, I'll use the same function same way. I'll simply change the unit. So I'll use y and m. So it returns 7 that is 7 months. So 8 years and 7 months. And now I want to get days as well. So rest of the days. So I'll use d m d as a unit and hit enter. So it says 8 years, 7 months and 12 days between these two dates. So date diff function is the easiest way to calculate difference or count you know the, the exact difference between two days. So I'll share a link in the description uh, if you want to learn more about the date diff function.